My thoughts are we are in the middle of World War III on its own version. This one is a ransomware attack, one of the worst you can deal with, because this means that the attacker reached inside your system. It's like, think about it at your home. He's already inside your home, he's already on the safe, and maybe taking two hostages and sitting on it. Tell me the password now. And saying, if you don't pay me this money, I'll take care of the hostages. So, so ransomware attack is the worst. And the point here is, even when you pay the money, they still have the data. There's also a few types of ransomware attacks. Some doesn't know how to, doesn't really take over the data. They just encrypt it. They lock it for you. So you can see it as well. That's, I would say, a little lower grade because they give you the encryption code when you pay them the money and take the, your data back. And some really take the data. And my assumption, this will happen here. It's not announced yet. It was a ransomware attack. It was not a service denial attack, which means that the attackers have actually put control of the data of the check-in and the passengers of five of the big airports in Europe. Now, most of the media is talking about how the service is slowed, how check-in is done manually, how the traffic, air traffic has. But my main worry was like, okay, what happened to this data? It's, it's taken.